Okay, there's a lot of things that I've done sitting at this chair, talking to this computer, and I'm going to talk about that today. So, what exactly made me talk about what I'm about to talk about? Well, I'm in the process of trying to like move my life away from the internet because I've become so integrated with things like social media, things like online communities, and just so many other things that um, I'm really wasting my time. And although I'm in a lot of great people, I've made better friends that I have in real life, and all this other stuff, I gotta like, <laughs> take a step back, you know? I need to take more than a step back. I need to, like, I need a leap back. And I have been, I quit Discord recently, um, and that was a big jump for me um, in terms of getting away from the internet because I spent a lot of time, or I did spend a lot of time on Discord. And and I used to have a YouTube addiction, but that's not so much a thing anymore because I just, I don't know, I don't consume the same way I do. It's mostly for music, and music is something I enjoy. And so it's less of an addiction. Um, it's, I don't know how to exactly put that way, but I still have things like Twitter. I still have to somehow branch off and get into different, like, mindset. Because online, it's just, it's so much easier to do things um, than in the real world. And it, it's tough. I'm going to have to make a lot of sacrifices and really reorganize my entire life. Um... But yeah, um, I don't know why I'm even talking to you about this, because it's only really me watching. I know I have 79 subscribers, maybe, and I don't really care about that. I don't really care about this channel either, because what it used to mean doesn't really mean what it is today. For me, I've grown up, I've done all this other stuff, and... <laughs> God, what is this? A, remor a memorial for me? Kind of. But it's... I, I don't know. I'm here because maybe I'm in desperation. Maybe I do want someone to talk to. And maybe my friends are way too judgmental that I can't even bring up stuff because of the context that they're in. Maybe I'm right here sitting at this seat because I've sat at this seat for so long and I haven't like branched off you know I I really want to do more art okay and how am I gonna do that well I have to take time away from me just wasting doing other stuff I it's not a wasting either it's really complicated and I'm not good at <laughs> explaining these things but trust me on this, I, no one really cares about what I'm saying either. Um, it doesn't, I, whatever. <laughs> uh, <sighs> yeah, I just, people don't really understand my situation because I don't explain it well. People don't, and, and maybe, maybe I should explain it better. But, <laughs> it's like, imagine you're really close with somebody, okay? or just with other people. And then you distance yourself a little bit, and because they miss that chunk of time, you have to catch them up. But then they miss more and more and more, and and then they just become distant from who you are today, or that's at least what you feel like. And that's kind of what I'm running into, is, I don't even know. There's a lot of stuff I could talk about. There's a lot of things that I wanna bring up but, and, it's really hard finding an open-eared friend. It's, so many people have their own problems. And although I do want to listen to other people, I, I, because it's, it's all really complicated, I guess. I don't really know anything. <laughs> I do, but... Do I really? I think what my biggest issue is, and what I, not my biggest, what my biggest solutions, I guess, should be to write down what I want to do, or what I need to do. And 
these thoughts come to mind at random points. But if I just write them down and I'm like, oh, hey, I'm, I can focus or whatever. I just, maybe I can do better, but. <sighs> okay. What did I even talk about? <laughs> Five minutes in and now I'm feeling like I'm going to make sense in a few moments. So. Imagine you're, you're just so torn apart, different. You don't have a solid friend group. So because of that, you sway between different groups and have different experiences. And maybe even your close friends are branching away from you. And so you're really, you're just really confused of how everything fits together. You know you mean a lot to a lot of, a lot of other people but you don't know how much they mean to you. And because of that, you you push yourself away from really getting to know that person because maybe you feel like there will always be someone better. You're going to end up getting better friends. But it's not exactly that. You don't think about that in the moment. You always think about stuff in reflection you don't judge people for who they're in the moment but if you're thinking back on it then maybe you will and ultimately you apply your values and things that you feel like other people care about onto others when they really don't when you were just very far from the truth and maybe you Maybe you wish somebody could understand things the way you do. And your attempts at it have proven to be really beneficial. And it's not like all hope is lost or anything like that. You're... Okay, I keep on saying you. <laughs> I don't really talk about myself. Uh... <laughs> yeah. I hope I made sense. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna talk about a few other things. Uh, number one, turns out people really don't understand what asexuality is because, um, yeah, I, uh, I've been talking to a few people about it. I'm becoming more open about it and definitely having discussion, but I am honestly su surprised about how little people really, like, think about um, aces and all that kind of stuff. But, um, yeah. So, uh, I'm going to close things off by saying I'm working on some art. You know, I have actually some art on the back of this laptop. I don't know if I want to take it off. So I won't. But at some point, maybe I'll show it. And... If you're if you really watch this entire thing, I just want to say, um, I'm I am here for you. Literally, if you're gonna dedicate this much time into watching a stupid video, um, I will listen to you. I will really care about you, because despite me not putting anything to you, you still put effort into watching this. So, hey, you can give a little something back, but. I'm not, it's not more about like always evening it out or just like always returning the favor. It's more like, oh, hey, you actually did something nice. So uh, you should just be rewarded for that. It doesn't have to be about me, you know, like, or mm, I don't really know. My morals are really stupid. <laughs> they often contradict, but the logical reasoning and a bunch of my stuff has to be like laid out in the right manner for it to be understood. Anyway, this video is getting long. No one's gonna watch this. It's not gonna be recommended to anybody because YouTube algorithm is broken. Thank you. And if I mention the word YouTube, then people are gonna watch this video more. Anyways, have a great day.